Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to uh, use custom text when you're viewing your fonts. So you know if you normally if you go into your fonts and your settings here, you know it has the default text. And if you want to do some custom text, uh, you could type it in for a specific font. Like that, but that only shows you for this one font here and you go back. Then you have to do it for each one. So let's say you're looking for maybe the letter G, look, you know, looking for a certain way. And you don't want to have to go through all your fonts. Then even in the... Uh, a control panel fonts, the same kind of thing. You can view the fonts, but you can't even do any custom text. So what you can do is you could use this free tool called Win Fonts View. So free download, it's just a zip file. Then when you extract it, you just run the executable, nothing to install. So just double click it. And it's kind of a good way to manage all your fonts in one place here. Uh, it shows you the listing and it shows you various samples. And what you could do too, you want to see them all in bold. You want to say italics, underline, just like that. You want to save selected items, copy selected items, HTML report. This is kind of cool. If you want to do a selected fonts or all items, you could do this. It'll open up in a web browser. And there you have a listing of all your fonts that you could print out just to get like a, a master view of them. Uh, other stuff, you know, right click, uh, save, copy. Like when you, do, when you do a copy, say you open Notepad here, it just puts the name of the font. So if you wanted to copy the name of the font real quick, you could do that if it was a long name. Or you could do the reports from here, choose the columns if you don't want to have all five samples you could do so. But the best part is when you go to the uh, advanced options, like I said, if you wanted to do the letter G, let's say, and all character sets, you could change that. Now you could see you could see how G looks with every single font. So let's say you're looking for a certain style, more like this and not like this, for example. You could scroll down and do that. Or if you want to do, let's say, a specific letter, you know, or word, I should say, just to see how it looks. capital letters too. And then if you want to change it back, you could just go to the drop down and pick one of the uh, defaults here. Like so. So it's a pretty cool little font manager program. You know, like I said, it's free and nothing to install. So I'll put a link in the, the uh, description and you could download it and check it out for yourself. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. <laughs>